No, we're going all score shot. Alright. Well, we might need an engine there. Hello everybody! After my video about the gun metal update and the exceptional changes that this score shot got, I was really waiting for a real test on the battlefield, and not alone, but having at least three score shot pyros, well upgraded of course. So what can be better than Caligino's caper, wave 66 when you can swim in the money? Someone could argue that the use of these score shots would harass not only the enemies but also your teammates because you let the mission long lasting because of the huge knockback. So I would not recommend doing so in a team of randoms. But if you have friends like me, all coming from the same party, Pluto as a quick fix medic for the lols, new gaming, Quata, his friend Stranglejerk, Bombitri and later RDA, there is not a problem testing and having fun with this capable new knocking device, in my opinion. My other weapons loadout are of course the power jack despite this nerf, but the speed buff is still invaluable. And the phlogistinator, because who cares of the hair blast of the flamethrower when you have a score shot so powerful. The phlogistinator comes also in handy because the igniting abilities of the score shot allows you to charge your meter very very quickly and keep the precious criticals for the tanks. The awesomeness of the new score shot is that until Valve fix it, the knockback versus the giant is pretty huge. Your score shot will knock back an upgraded, almost as like as an maximized air blast upgraded flamethrower. And that's crazy! Sure, because we won't harass the whole mobs of the robots, er, no robots. These should be ghosts, right? We are in the wave 66, okay. Okay, let's move on. Back on topic. We want to inflict the maximum harassment to the enemies. We'll upgrade the reload speed of the score shot to this ammo and maximize firing speed. It's almost a burning projectile SMG, a machine gun something that can block giants even before they drop into the field, something that can separate giant passion from giant medics because of the knockback, pretty awesome new abilities. Later on, while the cash comes in, we'll upgrade the damage and the rest of cash will go to buff the resistances, the speed of the pyro and of course the phlogistinator because it's always a godsend. Caliginus Caper is well known because of its large number of tanks, 9 in total, lot consequential, spawning while you are dealing with spies, and so on. So far, it's time to see what can 3 score shot pyres do against the longest Valve's official mission. Provided you stay in the nearby of a full upgraded dispenser, you have infinite ammo to indefinitely knock back all the enemies. And see here, we can already knock back the enemies despite they're in the uber state, not even have dropped into the battlefield. As I told you, this will come in a very handy ability while a giant will come with a giant medic, because you can select and knock back only the medic and divide the two. We'll see soon. Well, you'll see that despite the extravagant team composition, three pyros, one quick fix medic, an iron bomber demo man, apart the very first minute of this mission, the enemies won't be allowed to pass the very first part of the map. They won't reach even the stairs at the beginning. This is intense dodging. Uh. My final level is too dodgeable. Red and blue fireworks at the same time. After all, I am a tryhard, so I think it's a waste to keep the phlogistinator charged and not using it. Now you'll see that using the phlogistinator can put you in a more dangerous situation than simply knocking back 
until all the mobs die. See, sometimes using the Phlogistinator is too dangerous. But we have a quick fix medic, so who cares? Reviving for the win! <laughs> I am a jerk. I like to push the robots back outside the battlefield. Go home, robots! Go home, gods! Well, definitely, by using three score shot this way doesn't seem as hard as you could imagine. It seems an easy mission. And I am so stupid and not used to use ammo canteens that, despite I have both one, I would never use it. And instead we'll rush toward a dispenser on an ammo crate. Silly, silly boy. Now time to put the $1,700 in good use, pretty much maximizing all the worthful upgrades that still miss. Even the poor sentry buster, when you pin it to the wall with this damn machine, its algorithm will say that it's time to detonate. It's pretty cruel, but goodbye sentry buster! Really, this thing together with the fact that you can really separate the giant medics from the patients will put this score shot and the pyro in general in a different light. After to see this update, the medic and the soldier got so buffed that pyro got rendered useless to the majority of the people, but now, now it can regain the right place in MVM as a tank buster and a separation machine or sentry buster denial. Nothing is written in the stone, but I'll show you the new abilities. And since the new infinite refund that Valves allows, I'm pretty sure that I'll see some pyres in one wave or another in all the tools of Manap.
Maybe it doesn't work. I don't know about this one. Okay, now it's time for the giant medic. Let's see what the new score shot is capable of. That's unbelievable. Oh, dying because of a spy in a team of three pyros. Dang. Thanks God, we have Pluto. Those giants, they are at our mercy. The only thing that a giant quick fix medic can do against the knockback is activating his mega heal that stop all the knockback, but he'll die eventually. And those tanks, with three pyros around, they fall like leaves. Now it's time of the spy phase, the most threatening of the Caliginus Caper, but we are three pyros, so we are pretty skilled in spy checking and have an advantage over them. I'm roaming around the tank because I can have at least a small visual of the surroundings. Look how I can knock back Pluto despite being a teammate. <laughs> Just know the infamous bug of the score shot that from distance can knock back also your teammates. I do hope Valve will fix at least this very soon because you already can harass for example your sniper teammates while they are trying to get a aim. And that's not happen only in MVM. This glitch works globally. Logistinator proven to be more dangerous than the score shot.
Definitely. And now the last part, the part with the Uber medics paired with the heavies. They are not a problem for the scorcher because it can knock back even Ubered pairs. We have the victory in end. So far guys, what do you think about the score shot after you have seen how Caligino's caper could be wrecked havoc this new device and despite deviating a lot from the meta our three pyros one quick fix medic a primary demo man could win so easily this mission Maybe. let me know your testing and wait if valve keeps it untouched or debuff it <laughs> under mvm hope you enjoyed and thanks for watching